Hello friends, today we will discuss how to determine hypoglycemic effect of insulin in rabbit. Here these are the requirements. Animals, healthy rabbits of weight range 1800 to 3000 gram. Drug, insulin, instrument, glucometer for the estimation of blood glucose level. Reagent, normal saline, hydrochloric acid, 0.5% phenol and 1.4 to 1.8% glycerin. Now, principle. As we know, insulin is a peptide hormone and it is a secreted by beta cells of pancreas in response to high blood glucose level. This released insulin acts on insulin receptor and activate glucose transporter to absorb more glucose into the cell. Insulin regulates carbohydrate, protein and fat metabolism in body cell. Inhibition to insulin release. Reduced blood glucose level inhibit release of insulin. Stimulation of alpha cell of pancreas to release of glucagon and glucagon play important role to maintain glucose level in body by glycogenolysis and gluconeogenesis. So, aim of this present study is to evaluate the effect of insulin in rabbit at different time intervals. Now, procedure. For the experiment, we have to select three healthy rabbits of weight range 1800 to 3000 gram. Then, they should be maintained in uniform diet for seven days. Fast the animal for 18 hours with no access to water before starting the procedure. Now, how to prepare the insulin drug solution? Weigh 20 units of insulin accurately and dissolve it in normal saline. Acidify the solution by hydrochloric acid and maintain pH up to 2.5. Add 0.5% of phenol and preservative and 1.4 to 1.8% of glycerin and make the final volume to 20 units per ml of solution. Now, withdraw the 2 ml of blood sample from marginal air vein of rabbit and estimate initial blood glucose level by using glucometer. You can use another suitable biochemical method for glucose, blood glucose level estimation. The concentration of glucose can be noted down as initial blood glucose level. Then inject 1 unit per ml to the animal. Check the blood sugar level up to 5 hours afterward at the interval of 1 hour each. The determined blood glucose level as final blood sugar level and compare initial and final blood glucose levels. Now observation table. Prepare the observation table similarly. Here initial blood glucose level can be put in this column and final blood glucose level at different time interval can be put in this side. Thank you.